Looks like Dodge's seam sealer failed again. This top piece here is the seam sealer. It was between the wheel house, the inner wheel house, and the uh, bedside. And they obviously grab moisture, absorb moisture, and that's what happens. All that power rust. Steel video, I forgot one side cut out. Got to take the three inch roll ox and grind all that rust out. And put a uh, 3M rust prep on it. And then uh, I'll make these holes round. And then I like to plug them because when I finish everything, I go into the tail light up underneath through here on both sides go down through the pocket in that way and of course I'll do that way to uh, undercoat them, seam seal it and then cavity wax them. Um, that way everything runs down in here and down in that lip and reseals it but this time it definitely won't absorb any moisture or anything like that piece of factory sealer did. This is the way it was on the truck. This is the outside. It was against the bedside. And then turn it around. This is the inside that was facing the wheelhouse. So you could see. It was definitely sealed. But I don't know what it is. That stuff it absorbs. I got past the rust, prep this up, and treat it, and uh, cut a piece out of my new panel. Just a little update on the 07 Dodge 1500, and I got the uh, cab all bagged up. So I'm on a 400 the headlights, and cover them up. Then I'll 400 the bumper and uh, blend it here on the, those corners, blend the color. And when I'm done with that, um, then I'll pull the masking off the headlights. When I clear the bumper, I'll clear the headlights at the same time. That way we look in here and get rid of that crap you see on top. Here up, sun fades. All right. Peace.